Hello. So we are going on a one day trip to Rio. So we're not staying there. We're just going to and back. So we are going snowboarding and tubing. Also, ignore my nails. We're not going to talk about that. So we're doing that tomorrow. We're leaving tomorrow at 6 in the morning. And I have to finish all my work today so I can be good for tomorrow and not worry about anything. So yeah, I'm going to take you guys with me, my loyal subscribers. <laughs> So I've been very busy, but I forgot to show you guys when I was packing. So first of all, it's going to be like 20 to 30 degrees there. So I'm taking my snow gloves, a lot of face masks because you never know. Disinfecting wipes just to be safe. A car charger. So like in case I need battery when I'm in the car, but honestly, I'm probably going to just be sleeping. My beanie, which is really cute. I got this at H&M. it because I don't want to stink, you know? A chocolate and cream because in case my hands get dry because of the, the cold weather. Caramel apple pop. Extra, um, like, sweatshirt and some sweats. Chapstick. My wallet. Hand sanitizer, but I need to fill it up. And I'm also going to take my airpods and my laptop because i might need to do some homework on the road also look at my taco piñata isn't this so cute but yeah that's what's happening we're gonna leave at six in the morning trying to do all my work tonight and so far i'm doing good i just need to do some quizzes and i'll be done for the night also i just got this today and i'm gonna take it with me I got a Squishmallow. This is my first one and it's literally so soft. I think I'm going to use it as a pillow and I'm also going to take blankets. So yeah, this was an investment. Um, yeah. It's literally 12.42 in the morning and I just finished my homework. Turns out I had four quizzes instead of two, so yeah, I was stressing out, but I'm about to sleep with my Squishmallow, and I'm trying to be quiet because everyone is sleeping, but I'm excited for tomorrow, and I'm nervous. Come on. In the morning, I'd rather be asleep. I'm so tired. I don't know if this is for real or if it's makeup. And it's so cold, I'm shivering. I'm so cold. I really don't know if this is enough, but we'll see.
Oh my gosh. I should have put on my boots. Okay, so it's windy here and like whenever it's the wind comes, snow like gets on you like rain and it feels funny. But I'm like, oh can you see it? <laughs> I'm really cold and I'm shivering and I'm I got dizzy because of the mountain. And I was trying to not to focus on that, but I kinda have a headache now. I think I need to drink some water. I haven't drank water. But yeah, I'm like super cold and my crocs are getting ruined. It's okay though. Oh, I cannot put on this boot for my life. What the heck? I don't know how to put this on. <laughs> it's cold. You got your boots on. <laughs> We're about to get our snowboards. Here's my other shoe. At least it fits. I'm gonna go get like all geared up right now though. Cause I need my hat and my gloves. horizontal plane but look at the view guys look at it i don't know if you can even hear me I hope you can hear me, but we just finished tubing. Mimi's back there. Um, this was so much fun. The last one it was crazy because it felt like a roller coaster. I had to close my eyes. But we are done. It's like 4 o'clock now or like 3 45. So we're gonna go eat now. Guys, we just finished tubing and we're gonna go eat now, I think. But I'm sweating and it makes no sense because it's super cold outside. But I think because I had a bunch of layers and I'm out of breath. And I think I've burned a lot of calories today. Let's check. 1,800 calories and it's barely 4 p.m. I've gotten 11,000 steps today. That hasn't happened since quarantine started. Anyways, look at my squishy. My little squishy. You should go get them before they sell out at Target. I'm hungry. Okay, I'll update you later. <laughs> Okay guys, we're 
we're in El Paso. We're not home yet, but we're in El Paso. We are home. Literally just got home. But I was editing the video while I was on the road because we didn't have service for a little. So I was like, might as well edit, you know? So I saw in the part that I had my epic story time, the wind was too loud. And I fell and like I tested my knee because one of my legs was connected to the wind. skiing by myself and, or I was snowboarding by myself and going up the mountain again like the, the bunny the bunny slope it was like kind of tiring you know so it's like you know what? I'm gonna make it easier for me and I'm gonna go on a ski lift and I've never been on a ski lift like no one has ever told me what to do on a ski lift so I go like and they're like you have to have your board on so I'm like what the heck because I don't know how to walk with a board yet so I'm all there and like Apenitas, like I get on and then I'm going on it and it's like super high and I'm like hanging on to my life and then once I get down he's like straighten out your board y yo de mensa I thought straight meant like okay so pretend this is my snowboard I thought straight meant like this so my legs were like that right I thought he meant to like get off like that but no he meant straight like this so I could just slide off no I went off like this and obviously it's gonna stop me so I flipped over and then he had to explain to me and honestly I did not care what he was saying because I just wanted to get out of there because I was like it hurt you know like my knee twisted and everything so I was like okay whatever and then yeah he's like okay stand up so I stood up and then he pushes me off to make me to go and oh my goodness I fell again and then after, yeah, like after a little bit, he comes back. He's like, you okay? I'm like, yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine. Like, you can see in the video that he came back to me. But yeah, the the ski lift thing literally stopped because of me. Because I didn't know what to do. But it wasn't my fault because I didn't know what no one told me. So when my sister went, I told her, like, okay, you don't go off like that. You go like that. I mean, it's kind of like common sense. But honestly, se me fue. Se me fue, guys. So yeah. But I'm finally home now. I'm about to take a shower. Date. This is the day after, but I slept so much. My body is not sore, but I did get sunburnt over here. Like, just right here a little bit. And then over here. And I didn't think of wearing sunscreen, obviously, because it was snowy. But I now know to put on sunscreen. And my nose. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.